Greetings friends and welcome on my channel, I am bringing you the new episode of Biter Bite series and I must say we get farthest as we know in this series than in those before so that's a really good message I would say, the, the, the sign however, uh, there was some minor changes from the last episode until this one because I did some errands and some change in the processing of those alien ores. Now we are processing alien ore number one in the four production lane and the rest it's focus on alien ore number two. Also I grab all those loosely put boxes around the whole base and as you can see now we don't have actually enough alien ore to produce something decent what we still having it's the storage of the alien ore tree over here which we'll soon use to produce some uranium hopefully after we know what to do with that we still don't know how to process uranium at all okay so also i extend up to for two machines over here so now we're using only piercing ammunition to our defenses on the both side i upgraded or we together upgraded this lane of copper to steel smelters because we need definitely more copper in that and i think that's it i didn't change anything else except those and i maybe did no i definitely did some picks of my mistakes which was being noticed by you thank you all for your comments you're not noticing my mistakes advice and support on my channel anyway so i think i fixed those smelters which was uh, fill with copper and also as Dominic recommend me I cap those boxes with sulfur yeah Dominic you had you was right uh, I forget to cap those boxes so now these boxes are full of sulfur which it's not bad because you know now we have a decent buffer for that today I would like to do something with chemical science and for that oh or then we need to produce red circuits okay so uh, and of course uh, some other things like uh, I don't know uh, sulfur acid and plastic yeah we need to produce plastic and explosives and lots of things we complete we need completely build the chemical production now uh, I maybe should do this a little bit differently because now we are oh oh that fish is gone okay my bad so no actually landfill this part and we will continue that way and i will grab those fishes at the trees come on fish 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 okay landfill all that Have some decent space for builds now I am thinking about moving this whole thing a little bit to the left because it's in my way definitely and I completely forget that I need to also do some hmm, maybe we can do it down over here oh screw it I will put another lane over there why not oh mm, this pipe 
This one goes there, this one goes there. This is pipe for feeding all those flamethrowers around our secure perimeter. Mm -hmm. uh, I cannot do it over there, so I need to feed. And this... It's nightmare. Maybe I can do... Something like that. Right. And connect it together at least like this way. And it's short, but never mind. I can take some straight pipes like that. Here we go. Which will leave this part empty. So we can put chemical plants over there to produce some plastic I know it's not ideal Let's grab some chemical plants. Like half of that stack. Where they are. Also, I switch completely into red speed of the belt and underground and so on. Okay, here we go. So for Oh, also we need to do some titanium ore in the future. Okay, so we need coal and... Yeah. We have coal belt up there. Yeah. You know what? Really? I think we should move this whole section. Yeah, and do like on this section and over here. Uh, leave that space for future cracking and now uh, only for. Uh, okay, you know what? I uh, will put this tank somewhere like i don't know over there then make one of those pumps where is it do we know pumps yeah i need to oh we are not producing those anywhere <coughs> that's bad However, we are producing somewhere some few motors, right? Yes, over here. Uh, which should be enough for now. I will pump out all content of that. Stop filling, please. To save that sulfur acid, yeah, because that's full tank and uh, it's a shame to move with the full tank. And lose all that content, right? So let's let's leave it, pump it over there. Here we go. We still don't know that better recipe because we need for that. And okay, I forget to do some. Yeah, I want belt immunity, and I want that. And I don't know what that is, but let's research that. And what else? Ooh, rocket turret. Oh, give me some of those. They will be... I bet we will need them in the future. Okay, let's cancel all that. There we go. Give me that tank. That, 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 that. No. I will grab the whole thing like that and place it uh, 
behind that. No, uh, I need to move that so far because otherwise everything's take a long time to down me down. Sorry, I know this is a really stupid way how to do it, but it's necessary. I want to move the whole thing. Okay, okay. okay. Mm, this is still producing from the rest? Okay, never mind. That's actually fine. Move this one over there. And let's plan the whole production. Even though we don't know right now that recipe for advanced wrecking but after we know that recipe we can uh, we will have some space for it okay okay and then the rest all in this box which leave me with that now cap cap check okay and so whole thing and so whole thing Thank you. For now, then place that back. But I want to be sure that we have decent space before I pump back that sulfur acid so let's plan that for we will need water and heavy oil and then we will output some light oil right with Ooh. This will be really tied together, I think, like that. So there will be, there cannot be. So there needs to be one tile gap. Like that, probably. It should be input of whatever that is. Let's say like that, but with this different recipe, which I don't know. And let's move this whole thing in front. I think this over there. And actually cancel the one. And place. I don't know. I don't have any assembly machine. Assembling machine in my inventory. Why? Nobody knows because I use them for some. Yeah, I use them for those alien ore processing lanes. Give me that stack. What I am thinking. What I am thinking is to use the spacing of that to have opportunity in the future place beacons between. Right. Are important. Uh, we can do like that. Then. Okay. That could be something. No. Uh, output will go into those. Like there and there, there and there. Sure. That should be it now. Uh, I can squeeze another there. And see if I move it, I can squeeze another over here. Which give us 12 of those. So let's move this whole thing. Sorry about a little bit in the front. 
and place another potential production line for the future, which will give us 12 of those over here to crack heavy oil into the light oil. And if I copy and paste this whole thing, give me that. And move it down here. Let's say that high. We will have the same setup for light oil. And then we can bring the output of. of uh, so. No. <laughs> I completely forget. Petroleum gas, yeah. The output of petroleum gas back into that pipe or directly into those production and so on. Now, mm, in this special... I'm also thinking about using more than one production for sulfur acid right now. So it's maybe be good to... We are planning everything right. I can place another of those. So, like, mirror those over there. Yeah, let's do that. And without that, that or that, actually, this can just go there. Uh, Chadak robots use red belts. Use one underground from here to there into the tank. And we can easily. Oh, I'm out of pipes and everything else. Awesome. Do I have those? Yes. I can finally leave. Ooh, damn it. I know robots. I forget. We need to move all that sulfur again. Ah, that's horrible. Two of those product uh, sulfur acid. Let's grab more chemical plants. Fourteen. Okay. What else? I need? yeah, lots of pipes. What is good that I don't saw. I don't hearing any beeping noise. Can you believe that? Okay. I spoke too soon. Let's check that. Oh. So right now we have actually production of the alien ore over here. Yeah. They chew on that wall a little bit, but that's fine. We have those two belts running with alien ore into that one special place where it's separated, filtered and converted into the these three main ingredients for our production. Yeah. We don't have much of stone. I see especially oh because this needs to be updated to the faster speed. Yeah, these are and okay not much of we are a little bit missing enough of iron ah that's bad okay hopefully we can deal with that right now to be there you don't need to be there and let's put those up there that was it Yes, I think we have all sulfur uh, back in the boxes. Let's get those. Let's get this one. Let's get this place completely full. And maybe I should just copy and paste that. Okay, now what we are missing? Uh, more pipes, chemical plants. There we go. So we are planning in, in in ahead, right? But we know what we need to what will we need 
This is really slow. Can I make some of those in my inventory possibly? Oh, and I'm missing more chemical plants over there. Sure. Uh, chemical plants. I can even I can even hold my thoughts. Ah, damn it. That's it now. I forget to place Yeah, I know. The power between those but uh, let's do it like that and I should start to using those. Uh, that. And then connect with this one. Here we go. Oh, so we need to move that, right? Yes. So one of those. Uh. I want straight pipes. I don't have. Damn it. Like that. Over. Which will output all that. Now we need water. And water is this pipe, so we can easily connect these two together. And also, we need to connect. This pipe and you know what? Water pipe. Uh, water. No. Uh, underground. What the? Something like that with the splitter over here. And water pipe. We are missing a little bit of that. Actually, we are missing the whole pipe with that. So I will just do that. So now we have full production, double production of sulfur acid. Mm -hmm. And we can build underneath. The full production for plastic. And first I need to grab some coal. Because that belt is completely... enough oh, we eventually can upgrade those belts which are inputs for that production now i want that landfill because we are running out of space over there
Well, that's bad. Okay, let's put those slow ones back. I need at least a little bit of uh, stone over there. And maybe I will need to uh, prioritize the stone from the alien ore. This is horrible. Okay, now we are over here. What I want to do was to bring cobalt over here. Let's leave that little pound over there, like that. We will have eventually some uh, special things to make holes with water in the future. I put that mod in to this game. But right now, okay, let's do that truck. Mines, that, that, that. Oh, and advice all for things. That's what we need really, really soon right now right let's move that pump check over there and later we can land for that you don't need to make that okay now plastic we have coal over there we can bring it down here and we can actually copy and paste I, this whole setup. Uh, hmm. Actually, we cannot. We cannot. Because we need about behind. Which will have coal on it. Plastic. And then, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like that. Like that. over here that over there and then plastic will be output on this belt like that uh -huh. and call from that side okay let's put this over here like that for now grab more those yeah I doing this build very very close together but because we don't have much space on this map as you know we need already to but we can I think <laughs> landfill this whole part of the map I don't care this like it's really big and we have more water there and there it's not so big deal and how this defense wall is doing yeah lots of fire guns are full with piercing ammunition i did some upgrades to i did some tiers of strong uh psychic break damage and weapon shooting speed so now we are at maximum this really helps also oh we have already plastic that's awesome that's easy where the hell my robots take all my chemical parts here they are okay let's copy and place this that power ball and maybe with the 
well, right? Or so... All these should do eight. Okay. All these will do eight. So, well... Sixteen... 24, 28. Full or well. Yeah, that's a long production, but uh, okay. Uh, it's 10. And I didn't. Mm, God damn it, I do it again. You should be producing, you should be producing. I see more of those. However, I don't think we will be able, at least right now, to fulfill this whole production with uh, uh, petroleum gas because, you know, we have only like these three small uh, patches of, of crude oil, which is not much. Oh, uh, eventually, uh, this will be problematic. Now, why are you blinking with no electricity? Yeah, because I'm out of. I see. Okay, for us, these are not so far. And I never pull the box or those power poles. That's no mistake. There we go. Yeah, like that. Okay. Now, uh, let's measure how much of those. Eight. Eight is over there, I think. So. After eight, actually do that. The output on the both sides of the bell. Awesome. Now, this making twenty. We could extend that production to make 30 green circuit parts. However, mm, do I really want to use the all the one green circuits production for all that? <coughs> Maybe I don't. Let's measure how much of this is this is eating. Uh, Twelve. Okay, so it's using almost the whole belt. Okay, so we need the whole new production of green circuits. Yes. And if I seeing those, let's do first some upgrades. Because these are now, uh, you know, Mark 1 machines, let's do some Mark 2 machines. And then I think we should build another green circuit somewhere in this area. So let's. Uh, do more landfill, maybe. Or I could do second production right now. Have space over here. Uh -oh. Why there is a belt full of 
I never cancelled that belt. Okay. Hey, you don't need to be there at all. That's better. And place. Not full belt, probably, but half of that belt. At least to feed that and then we maybe have the full green full red belt of green circuits not green belt of or red belt for green blah, blah, blah. and we need to so from 30 green circuits we can make 15 red ones it should be five Let's say, oh, and we need to produce, oh, never mind, engine units, and engine units needs, where is it, engine, okay, over here, they are, don't need green, sir. okay, that's fine, so, let's do that. Let's make this to produce 30. We are done. And but I saw some negative numbers. We don't have enough copper. Oh. Also, there's another problem that we don't have. We don't have enough enough copper for two of those. So maybe I will leave this one and just upgrade that belt to be on the proper speed for the production. Ooh. Because half of that belt will be eaten by producing red science. So what's left? It's 18. I could actually do the half of that, which will produce those 15 which we need right now, and leave the whole belt. But we're also dealing with the space problem over here. I don't have enough of that to do that. So, the separated production of green circuit it is, and yeah, just dedicated only for producing red ones. Uh -huh. With that, with this, because red ones are plastic, electronic circuits, and copper. So, that's a lot of copper. We need copper for that, and four copper cables are or steel if we make 20 if we make 30 electronic circuits we can do 15 red ones to make 15 red ones we need 60 copper cables which is 60 60 copper plates because it's a one to one so 60 copper plates it's like two whole smelters and uh, up to that, or we need another three by, okay. That's a lot of copper, my friends. Lots of, lots of copper that we need to produce. So, a small smelter setup is definitely can handle that many of production. So we need to extend, extend very I will start Do I really need Let's first upgrade that smelter Now 
now it can handle double the amount. Double, produce double amount of steel. And yeah, the situation with iron ore, it's not perfect at all. And you should be red one, red one, red one, red one. All the way up there need to be red one. The same applies on the other side. Yeah. Oh, it's fine on the other speed. So now we updated the whole smelter into steel. To leave my inventory full of those normal ones. situation with with iron it's not good we don't have enough iron to feed all these oh it's actually four smelters three for iron and one for steel This belt is not completely full already. Oh. It's a huge attack. So, how to do it? I cannot squeeze more iron ore from that. I could. A little bit, not much. But this row producing a little bit more than that belt can handle. split between these two and this one it's definitely important one because it's one of those two okay we'll put a little bit more over there now also this one it's not mining because it's full of that copper let's prioritize this side side of the belt damn it that's not taking that copper evenly from both sides which making some problem uh, that will do that yeah this will help until we reach another copper over there copper at least right now in the future we will be wishing to have more copper 
Okay, maybe I will stop the production there. We need stone. And you should have no priority. Okay, these two are producing stone. So we will not produce much of copper from those alien ores. Because we have enough. The copper patch is actually the biggest one over here, which is uh, good, good news, uh, uh, good message. For but we need to squeeze another two belts from it, which also be a little bit problematic. Now, <coughs> I see how my military sign is going slowly. Uh, why? Because you are missing... Okay, because we are missing... Yeah. We are missing piercing ammunition around. Uh, because it's not produced in decent amount. Ooh, that's a big problem. Uh, huh, over there. So, why we are not producing... Yeah, it's a copper. It's an it's a iron... Iron production problem. Again. Oh, these are full. See? That's what I want to achieve. Now it should forcing to be over there. Shut up, beeping sound. Okay, let's place this in a red speed. Come on. Ribot. Out of red belts. Okay. Take. But I already seeing that this smelter will not produce enough steel for our for other things. Yeah, this producing 5.5. So yeah, that's not much. You need more of those, definitely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's, it's starting to produce a little bit more. Uh, this itself eating two and a half. So yeah. We need another steel smelter. And I don't know where to grab enough iron for that. Oh, I was on my way to grab some. Back. So there's a uh, lot of question mark in the future of our base, I would say right now, because this is your problem. Do you have? Oh, give me all those. Not all. A decent amount. Okay, here we go. And play the rest of the yellow ones back into there. Also, on where the underground litters go. No? Like that. And the rest it's gorgeous on the red. Uh, what I was saying is that I need some space somewhere. We will be doing a lot of... Ooh, that's a huge party. Uh, lots of land filling because I want at least that. We need to do that. To have decent amount of space. A decent part of this... Uh, I don't know, peninsula or, or half half peninsula or whatever that is. This land passed on between those two lakes. Lakes. Uh, okay. What I want to check, the last thing, it's we need to engine units for each of chemical science pack. Let's presume that we will produce... 15 advanced circuits, which means that we will produce 5 chemical science pack by 2 each 24 seconds, which is 10, which is 2.4 seconds for one blue, uh, 2.1 for blue, oh, actually, excuse me, 2.4 seconds for each chemical science pack. That's not, that's not enough. Because right now, our current speed is like 
150 per minute of those or 2.5 per per second okay let's grab the numbers from that one which is 108 see we need definitely bigger speed of producing chemical science packs which means that we need ooh, ideally mm, 100 and uh, let's say 100 which is 1.5 each minute each second okay uh, so if we want 100 we need 300 advanced circle per minute which is 1.2 per second uh, something like that and then whew, I don't know how much engine unit so let's forget about those numbers because we never be able to achieve those especially with the limited resources which we have right now which are quite limited um, uh, I am thinking about expanding we can expand and grab that iron ore. We can do the actually uh, the wall over there ish and grab that iron ore patch. Or that's it, I think. Uh, I don't see any other opportunity to do anything with those. Uh, or do. Clear all that up to another fall for there. But right now we are a little bit missing those clearing options, right? What definitely we don't missing are ooh, let's make those. We can have the first normal armor on us. What I'm missing? Plastic. Hey, hey. So I think I will end today video over here. We did some preparation for chemical industry and do a lot of un unnecessary things yeah also the longer longer uh, defense wall it's more alien or so it's also be beneficial to have a little bit of that right okay give me some of those and make some red circuits my friend okay Except, uh, I want to grab somewhere so proper cables actually. Cool. Damn it, pipes. Proper cable, do we have somewhere? Proper cables production. Oh, that's really far. Let's screw that. Let's grab some copper and make them. Where is it? Uh huh. Okay. Hmm. Also, we need explosives, right? So, yeah, I forget about that. But for explosives, we also need that coal. We need that coal about, uh, right? Are those explosives? And also, we need anything for that. Three of them, six of them, six of them to place into those to produce a little bit more from that small patch. Yeah, that's a lot of thing to do. Mm. And I was saying, oh, I can do armor, modular armor finally. Here we go. Oh, we don't need that. Oh, whatever and then maybe energy shield right rocket turret but we can equip like uh, ammunition oh we have rockets we have rockets and if we know explosive uh, actually produce explosive yeah we need coal suffer and water so coal belt can be theoretically split over there and in the future in the next episode we will build the explosive production over there i think okay 
And with that, and with the long queue to make some of those important things, I thank you all for watching, and I hope you enjoy today, goofing around, and see ya in the next video. Bye.